Hello everyone and welcome back to Mami no Gi Fate Slash Stay. So today we're going to be doing the perfect proof, right? So for this one you actually have to complete three events here. And you saw this, uh, some of do this in the last one, so I'm not going over it in much detail, but you have to do every single one of them. So first of all, we're going to be starting off with Honor, because I like Saber the most, and that's the one I chose to like start out with, because... I find personally find this one to be like the center point between the two after I played them all. So I'm gonna be putting up a guide uh, a little later this week. So this event will go on for about at 12 to 13 minutes. It seems to differentiate at like every single time, right? And then this will happen. Somewhere the strong presence has appeared. What is this place? It's pretty interesting, I must admit. I feel uh, something I've never felt before. Who is it? Very interesting indeed. I really like this guy's sword. It's like amazing. And this is the most like amazing part. Like if you could do this in Mobi no, that would be completely fucking badass. I expect that since he just wipes out like all the enemies in like one shot. You can actually see us up there, that's actually pretty cool. The past is gone, are gone. Now we shall, uh, okay, well. So pretty much what this is, is it's a boss fight, right? But it's not exactly how you would assume a boss fight would go. Like you can't die here and after a little while he'll just stop attacking you and just go away. But his attacks are very powerful, but you can respawn infinitely. Then, yeah, like I said, this seems to go around like the 30% mark, he'll just disappear. Actually, Saber was the closest I've ever gotten to since I got 29. Uh, I don't think you can actually kill him, but leave it down in the comments if you can. And then the same thing, but this time we'll do it with ideals so if you press uh the, if you press the honor one you got saber but if you press ideals you get archer archer of course has different skill sets uh, which is pretty amazing uh like i said i'll post a guide later this week on how to like do everything individual character because i find some of them are different than other ones and better strategies and then you have this one this one, you get Berserker when you choose Will. Personally, I don't really like Berserker. Uh, there is a way to actually like complete this. I know I've tried like twice, and then I actually kind of got it down. But I know that maybe some people will actually struggle with it, which is why I want to post these guides to like help everyone out in the community, right? And again, I wasn't able to kill this guy, and I do have to say I don't like Berserker like at all. However, after completing all of that, we actually get... Da -da -da -da, we can complete it. Oh, well, that's actually kind of normal. If you reported them all, I, uh, anyway. Then you get a token of proof. But what can you do with that, you might ask? Well, with a token of proof, you can actually buy something in this store. Now, I'm going to buy a title, because it's the only one I really want. And let's put it on, right? So titles do have come with special ability, like special stats, like you see, like max damage, critical strength, and things like that. So use this title, and now we are the Great Servant. So I hope you all enjoyed. I don't see anything new pop up, but maybe that will come later. So anyway, I hope you all had fun. See you all next time in the next one.